Well, how do there, chums? Tis I, Captain of the Steves. Now I'm back inside of Palworld. We're going to go and fight our very first boss. But before we do that, we've got a little bit of preparation to do. We've got to make ourselves some iron armour or metal armour. So here you go. I'm inside of game. Now I should have everything I need. I'm going over to my advanced workbench. I'm going in. And pelt armour. Metal armour is what I want. Let's make that. Let's get that on the go. Yeah. Let's get that crafting. Oh dear, that's going to take a little while. Hopefully some of my pals will come and help me, but we convene once they've made it. Okay, well I finished making said metal armor. Let's pick it up. Um, didn't automatically put it on though, did it? Alright, okay. Let's go inside of here then. And let's just uh, chuck that on then, I guess. There we go. And I can get rid of this armor or put it into a chest or something. I've got 50 arrows to take with me. Oh, I'm looking rather spiffing actually now, aren't I? Very nice. Okay, well, let's see if I can uh, do something with the headpiece, shall we? Let's have a look how much it costs to make that. Okay, I need some more ingots. Hmm, okay. I think I might have some that are on the bake at the moment. Let me just go and check, see how we get on with ingots. Have we got any in queue? We haven't gotten any in queue, and I haven't got enough ore. I might just go and get some ore, because we're not far off, and I'll make the headpiece as well. Okay, right, well, I think I might have enough ingots now. Let's go and see if I can make the headpiece. Let's go do that. X, and I can. I guess I can. Brilliant. Let's get that on the bake then. And that's probably going to take me a while. I just put some experience points into handicrafting. That's why it's going a bit quicker. Okay, done, Dillion, done. Let's acquire that. Let's go into your menu. Let's uh, see if we can get that equipped. Here we are. Let's put that on. Oh, wrong, wrong button, wrong button. Just press Y on it, and it puts it in the right slot straight away. It's a bit of a shame you can't see that on your person, isn't it? Uh, or can you? I don't know where I should be looking. It looks like it should be on the head, but I'm not seeing it. Oh, yes, I am seeing it on my head now. Heck yes, looks freaking ravishing. Okay, right, well, let's just go and stow my other bit of armour that I don't need anymore. Just so I weigh a little less. Let's go stick that into there. And I might as well put these in there as well, so I weigh a little less. I keep this key with me, just in case I come across a copper chest or something, people. Right, so I think I'm ready to go. Now, my actual party, I have got this guy, who's a, like a, a fire-like pal. I've got this guy, who does, like, earth moves and also grass moves. This guy that does earth moves. This guy that does earth moves. And this guy that also does earth moves. Why am I taking a shed load of earth-like Pokemon? Have I got enough room for one more? No, I haven't got up on my room for one more pal. The reason why I've got loads of earth Pokemon, or pals, I should say. I shouldn't really call them Pokemon. Is, a uh, this is an electric type boss that I believe we're going up against. A name's Zoe and, like, uh, Electro Buzz. It's not Electro Buzz. It's got another, another Grizzbolt or something like that. Anyway, I'm going to fast travel to where I last got to, which is just here. And I think the tower on the actual map, you can see it on the radial bar at the top. But it's over towards, like, the north, east, south, east, I think. North, east, south, I don't know, west. It's over in the west. There we go. Let's go there, then, and fast travel. Sweet. And, yeah, so the actual boss tower, I think, is... Where is it? Where is It's missing off my freaking radial map now, isn't it? All right, well, I think I know roughly where it is. I'll reconvene when I get there. So, people, I think it's that one over in the distance. So there's the church down by where the fast travel is, and I think it's this one over here. There you go. Now it's popped up on my freaking map. So it's 280-odd metres that way. So I'm heading there now. At least I think I am. Okay, well, I'm getting close. And you can see here, it's got those little reindeer-type creatures around here, which are earth types. And it's got those sort of, like, little seed-type dudes down there again that are earth types. So I'm wondering whether each of the towers is going to give you a rough indication of the sorts of pals that you've got to take in there in ways and means of what sort of is lurking around that sort of area. Now, I'm also trying to scope out a good place to put down, like, a second base when we get there. I want a place that's got a load of ore and is quite flat, so I'm just going to keep my eyes open for that. Oh, look, there's an egg just over here. We'll go pick that up so we can put that inside of our incubators a bit later, people. We'll take that with us. Nice. Heck yes, a verident egg. Heck nice. Okay, well, let's carry on going around here. All right, well, we're nearly at the tower. I was going to cut it, but I don't think it's really worth cutting at the moment, people. Aha, there's a fast travel point right outside of it. So we go and activate that. Hello there, chicken. 
Pick that up, might as well. There we go. Activate. Sweet. We head on over here. Pick that up as well. I'm not going to pick up too much because I don't want to be over encumbered and move slowly if that's a thing. What the fudge is that up there? We'll have to go look at what that is later as well, people. But for now, we're just going to go and fight this boss and see if we're okay to take it on. Now, I have got a fire sort of pal on me. And the main reason I've brought that one with me is I'm hoping it does burn damage to this freaking boss. Are we going to get a cutscene? I think we are. Yeah, I'll just shut up for a second just in case there's talking. No talking. Okay. Still no talking. You gonna say anything? No. Just a snazzy animation. I guess I haven't got voice actors or actresses yet. Well, hello! Does look like Electro Buzz, but it's called like Grizzbolt or something. Here we go. Zoe and Grizzbolt! Hi, hey, girls. I'm gonna kick your butt, Zoe and Grizzbolt. Okay. Go get him! Right. Well, I'm going to use my bow. Hiya! Yes, it's inflicted burn damage. Now all I'm going to do is watch my help of this little guy and call him back in when his when his energy gets low. Uh oh! It looks like I've aggroed him somewhat. Okay, he's after me now. Go on, inflict burn damage again. You know you want to. Yes, we've got burn damage on again, so that means that it's just going to take damage. It's going to tick down. Okay, he's really after me now. Ah! Okay, I'm going to bring out a different a different pal. Get him! Sweet. I'll hide behind this post while my um, pal does some damage to him. Go on, you can get him. Go on, little leafy dude. Do some bigger moves. Go on, leafy dude. Yes, that was a pretty good whack. Where's he gone? I don't see him. He's, he's behind the other post. It's all right. We'll just stay here. I'm not going to bother shooting him. I'm not going to aggro him anymore. I'm just going to let my little guy do us some damage. I mean, I think the boss is like level 13. And my little guy is like level 26. So this shouldn't be a problem. Hmm. I might throw out this guy instead for a sec. Let's see how he does. Yeah! Go on, get him. Oh yeah! Headbutt him. Go! Sweet, that's doing a lot of damage. Oh, he's, has he spotted me again? No, nope. he's still going after my uh, pal. My pal's kicking butt. Like, yes. Cool. Well, he just shot my little elk, and it did hardly any damage. So yeah, that's that's the bonus of having like ground pals against like an electric pal. He's not doing any damage to my pal. I just want to get to an angle where we can see the action, people. Yeah, it looks like we're going to hammer this in under the ten minutes with my elect with my um, earth pals. You know what? I'm going to throw out a different pal just just to mix it up a bit. Go get him, llama of death. Sweet. Malpaca is going at it. I think my um, purple reindeer was doing a bit more damage, to be honest. But, you know, that, oh, well, 508. Oh, that was a pretty good whack there. Go, Malpaca. You can get him. Yeah, that does, that does quite a lot of damage. That little sort of, like, mud ball that Malpaca's throwing at him. Just on a charge move as well. That done a heck of a lot of damage, too. Very nice. Okay, well, he's almost dead. Well, let's put in my dire wolf. Come back, Malpaca. Go get him, dire wolf. Get him. Quick. Um, dire wolf. Yep. He's chasing me, dire wolf. I expected more from you, my little dire wolf. Freaking get him. Ah. I got stuck on a post. Yeah, she's laughing at us, Electro Buzz. Get him. Sweet. I think we're about done. I think my uh, dire wolf is about to finish him off. He's doing quite a lot of damage and he's slightly faster. There we are. We've done it. Sweet. We got five ancient technology points. Is she going to talk to me now or anything like that? I don't know. Oh, unlock fast travel. Well, where the fudge am I then? I'm, oh, I'm at the top of the tower now, am I? Well, I'm quite interested to see what this little encampment is down there. 
It looks like everybody down there is tea posing right now. Well, they were. Okay, they've loaded in now. That's they're pretty okay. I think that's just a bad guy tamp. Oh look, there's a cage, and they've got they've got a freaking pal in it. I guess we're going to have to go and rescue them, aren't we? All right. I think the uh, fire one would be good for that. Let's go down there and let's go kick some freaking butt and let's go rescue that trapped little guy. Syndicate thugs, you're not going to know what's hit you, Syndicate thugs. I'm going to have you. I guess I am. There right, we go. Sayonara! Sakapow! Yeah, I'm going to burn an arrow you to death. Come on, fire... Yes! Freaking heck, you burnt him to death! You leave my little pal alone. There we go. Done. Is there one that I can't see? I, I guess... Nice one. Well, my pal defeated them come on back let's see what we can get out of here oh i haven't got one of these let's release this little guy come on little friend can i then capture it oh i've got it already a ribby bunny nice level eight ha 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 anything else for the having around here can i have anything else i say have nick steal rob and deplete um no there's no chests or anything around here Okay, well, I guess I could use the fast travel sign that I just went past and head back to my own camp. And what a lovely area. I need to sort of expand the map a bit more. I need to get a flying sort of pal so I can scout the areas better. All the ones I've come across so far, though, I've gone and accidentally killed. I don't know what that sound of being sick was just then, people. Is there any flying sort of pals around here? All right, well, I guess I'm going to look around in my own time. I'm just going to head back now. This is a nice bit of flat land, though. Oh, is there a cave over there? I think there is. Oh, I haven't got a torch with me, though. We're going to have to come back here. Nice. Maybe next episode we'll explore the cave. Actually, I could go in there and just bring my fire power with me, couldn't I? We'll do it now. We're going to do it now, people. Okay, well, let's uh, bring out my fire power. Come on, buddy. Hopefully you can light up the way. Let's head on in. Enter dungeon. Right, we'll go in. Yes, please. I have no idea what's in the dungeon. Yeah, how long is it going to take to load? Oh, not long at all. Nice. Right, go on. There we are, we've got a light. Oh, okay, there's fuddlers in here. I've already got a fuddler for my actual bows, which is pretty cool. They're, they're actually quite good for mining and stuff. Right, um... Mm, okay, I'm not too sure which direction I've got to go in here or what I'm, what the actual mean or aim of these places are. Okay. Oh, what's that? I haven't got one of them. Come back to my hand, guy. I'm gonna I'm gonna hit this guy. Pow! Ouch! Ah, yeah. Looks like he's gonna try and poison me, so I don't want that to happen. Get in the ball! 51%. We're going to capture him. Hopefully we are. Don't want to waste a ball. Sweet! Killer Mari! Captured. Popped a badge or something there, people. A hundred, uh, 20 different court thingies. Pals. Alright. Let's uh, mine this. What is it? What am I getting? Uh, I'm getting ore. Okay, that's going to get heavy fairly quick. But I do need more ore. So I grab this and I reconvene. Okay, well, we're heading into the next area of here. There's a load of fuddlers about. Okay, um, is this like where a boss might spawn? It looks like the sort of place a boss might spawn. Um, okay, or well, maybe not then. Oh, what's... Oh, there's syndicate thugs through that way. Let's go through here then. I kind of expected a boss to be in there. No bosses yet, people. Anything in here? Anything worth having? Big lake? I could guess I could swim through there. Right, well, let's swim through this then. Oh, that's not run. That's not swim faster. That's swim faster. Let's get through here. Hello. Oh, look. I need to capture one of them. I keep accidentally bloody killing them. Um, which isn't good, is it? Right, let's shoot him in the face. Oh, he's a boss one. Level 13. Oh god, I got stuck on the blinking scenery. 
Get him! Ah! Right. I wonder if I can capture him and give it a go. Go on! Get him! Oh, frickin' heck yes! I got him! Cool! I can put him down at my base. Is that the only boss that's in here? Hopefully. Uh, oh, look! There's a, looks like a chest over this way, people. And a way out. Nice. I don't know whether there's more than one sort of boss inside of these dungeons. It's the first dungeon I've ever done. Like it, though. Nice. Got ourselves a lovely pal. Got Oh, thermal underwear. Crossbow schematic. Very cool. All right, well, let's head into here. Leave dungeon. Yes, don't mind if I do. Thank you very much. Right, well, I fast travel back to my base. I'll see you back there. Well, rather than double back to the fast travel point that I was going to go to, I've gone this way, and it looks like there's a boss battle over there, but it looks like just over here, we've got a fast travel point right here. So what I'm going to do is unlock this, and in the very next episode, I'm going to be doing that boss battle that's up near to this fast travel point. There we go. Unlocked. I wonder if it shows me. Oh, it looks like a giant penguin king type looking thing. Yeah, Pen King. I was freaking right. I guessed his name. All right, anyway, let's uh, let's travel back to the base, and we'll be doing that next episode, people. There we go. Fast travel. Lovely jubbly. Right, -o, so I'm hopefully you're enjoying this. So yeah, I um, took out the first boss. I've done that fairly easily with the pal party that I had to hand. I mean, I could have just left one there, really, and done it all that way. I'm not too sure whether I got given anything amazing. I mean, I've got a, a ruby, I've got this precious dragonstone, but I think some of this I got inside of the actual odd place. You know what? Let's, uh, let's just go and put the egg in the old incubator. Let's leg it into the old egg incubator. Sorry, I wasn't showing you what I had on screen then, was I? So yeah, I got an egg, I got that thing, a ruby, I got a precious dragon stone, I've got crossbow schematics, I don't know how you go about using that one. Uh, okay, can be crafted at, oh okay, can be crafted here, can it? If I go into there then, can I use that crossbow schematic? I don't know how you go about using the crossbow schematic. Anyway, we come out of there and we put the egg in the old debris into the incubator. Why? Heck yes. There we are. Well, that's going to be on the bake. I'm going to exit out now, though, and we'll reconvene. I'll show you what we get out of that egg. And then we'll go and fight that boss next episode, people. So, yeah, back to me. And, uh, yeah, thank you very much for watching. If you like what you see, like and subscribe. Hit all those buttons. Share on social media. Yeah, heck yes, that'd be awesome. Till next time. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again.